Y'all know Kanye, Jesus is King, was supposed to come out this week. They said, oh, it's not coming out uh, Friday. It's going to come out Sunday after Sunday service. Going to church, taking everybody to church. It didn't come out once again. Maybe it'll come out next week, right? So I want to play this um, this freestyle he did in Queens for his Sunday service for today in New York. And I want to really, I just want to get into it. Because this, this is a thought I have. And it makes sense to me. So maybe it'll make sense to you about Kanye and using religion. For, like, what we get into? Let's listen to the freestyle. Niggas I have anything up that has to do with Jesus, I swear. This shit make it make me move a muscle. The beat in the back kinda hard though. I ain't gonna lie. That's kinda hard. I see in that tweet that said that nigga Kanye is stealing every black choir in America for his uh, press tour. So, like I said, I believe that Kanye West is using religion and it's, I don't want to say hold on the black community, but it's like, it's like deep rooted within the black, like church. I don't know about with millennials, but you all know church is deep rooted within the black community. You had to go to church every, every fucking Sunday, all that type of shit like that, right? So we all know about the whole Donald Trump. In any way, when I talk about this, I've never been like a Kanye, I hate him. Kanye is a piece of shit for the slavery comments or because he fucked with Trump. Because like I said in plenty of videos in the past about Kanye and Trump, people who get mad about that, I feel like they they look at Kanye as something more than what he is. Like, I don't look to my artists, to, my, to rappers, to singers, to actors, to whatever, for it to be my like political guider, like, oh, he fuck with Trump, so, uh, uh, or he likes Trump, so I can't, I don't look, I don't care about nothing, I don't give a fuck, right? Until it affects me directly, that's when I care. But like, if Kanye fuck with Trump, it's not affecting me, it's not making me whatever. Like, if Drake came out tomorrow and said, I love Trump, I'm still jamming. That was the same. I'm still jamming. I don't, I don't care about that. But it's just funny, and I know people say he he had Jesus walks. He he's been on you know he, he does gospel uh, samples all the time. I'm not gonna say I'm not saying he's never dibbled and dabbled in any of it before, right? But the Trump thing I felt was kind of, you know what I'm saying, as far as the black community goes, it's kind of detrimental to him. And I just feel like when you bring in church and you bring in religion, you start Jesus is king, and I'm only making gospel albums now. I'm done making secular music, I'm done making just rap. It's gonna be about gospel and this, and it looks like it's working. I don't know if these are just stage people, these are people just happy to be there, but from the video, it looks like the, the religious rollout, the, the religious get the black people back is working for him. And I don't know this nigga personally, obviously. I don't know what his intentions are. I don't know what he really like and he's like in real life. But it seems like a ploy, right? And can you really be mad at a ploy that's working? That, that people are kind of fucking with. Like, you see the people on Twitter who are speaking like I'm speaking like, eh, look at that nigga using God as a press room. Or look at him go to every black church in America and then do his album release for a bunch of white hips. Like, eh. It just looks, the, the thing, it looks, it looks bad. It looks off. Like, to use God, to use Jesus for, the, um, to gain you favor with people again, to get you kind of back to where you were. I still feel people, like people are off Kanye, right? Like, I was thinking, when I was thinking about this Jesus, I forgot, I didn't even know Jesus the King was coming out this week. And, I, and I'm not, like I said, I'm not, I, don't, I don't hate Kanye. The last one he had, uh, what the fuck was that called? Kids He Ghost? Or that, that was with him and Cuddy. Whatever the one, yay, yay. Loved it, great. The shit he had on there with that girl, I forgot the girl's name is, amazing, great. But I just forgot Kanye was even dropping shit. It's like, I don't, I'm, not, I'm not like running to look for it. Oh my God, Jesus is King. I want to listen to that. I know it's going to be great. I'm sure it's going to, I'm sure it's going to be great. Let me just be, be, be I'm sure it's going to be great. It's probably going to have great samples, going to have great raps, scenes, whatever, whatever. Because if it's anything like some of these Sunday service clips you've seen, it's going to sound good. But 
at the end of the day, he's using it, I feel like, to get try to canoodle his way back into like the black community. And when it works, he'll go back to just fall back into whatever the fuck he was doing before. You know what I'm saying? That's how I feel about it. I feel like it's, it's not like the greatest thing in the world to do. But if that's what it might be in his heart, like I might just be up here blowing smoke out my own ass. I might be blowing smoke out my mother. I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. He could really love God and well, he probably does love God, right? But I'm saying like, he 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 really this is his calling. He he feels like this is passion. I, I tried politics, but that only brought hate and negativity into my life. I tried to free my people through Trump and I tried to free my people through open minded and thinking and Candace Owens, but what would you need to do like they did back in the old days? Give them God. They, niggas love God. Give them that. You know what I'm saying? That's how I look at it. That's how I see it. So, 